Over here, Mavi. Mavi, Mavi, over here. Take the rings. Take a ring. Okay, go back to your team, Mavi. Run. Run, run, run. Back to your team as fast as you can. Good job, Mr. Baker. Way to go, Ashton. Who's next? So once again, a lot of similarities to these games. So many combinations. So this game here, what they're doing is they are running down their three teams now and they're just grabbing a ring. Doesn't matter, Kellen, just grab a ring, buddy. It doesn't matter, they're all the same. Go, go, go. And they're grabbing rings. They gotta form a blob of 12. There's three teams, we have 36 rings. Once the teams are all together with their blobs, then they switch over and this is where the thinking takes place because they gotta find the right pieces over here to fit into their blobs. So just a lot of puzzle pieces, a lot of teamwork again. Right now it's mindless running. Um, but it transfers over slowly from that mindless running to the thinking as they gotta go get those pieces over there. Good job, Bryce and Mavi. Good job, just grab one and go, just grab one and go. Every once in a while when we play this, one of the team leaders will tell their team just to grab one color. Makes it a lot easier. They get very, oh, look out. They get very strategic because then they only have to focus on finding one color insert instead of bouncing back and forth between blue and black. Good job, Philomena. All right, Kellen, you gotta grab one, bud. Just grab one, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter which one you grab, buddy. Just run and grab. Go, go, go. Kellen, go, full speed, man. We're almost done, we're almost done. Oh, up, up, up. Full speed ahead. It doesn't matter, just go. Oh yeah, bring it back, bring it back, bring it back. Bring it back, bring it back. I don't think you need that one. And then go get that. Yeah, there we go. All right, good job, London. I think that's yours, yeah? All right, over here, Kellen. Now they have to really start thinking. What was in my cluster? Which shape do I have to get? And now they run back to their team. Full speed, Kellen, full speed. Make sure you're looking at your pieces so you know what shape you need. Do we know which team's short one? All right, London, which one do you want, buddy? Ah, see, London's talking to his team. He's lifted two up, and he goes, hey, which one of these do you want, guys? So that's one thing that we really like to see in this game is when it's hard for young people, too, because they think individually, okay? Uh-oh, that's why we throw it back? No, we place it back. So now they have to work together uh, to make it work. So kind of a cool, fun game. Kind of follows our little model of uh, complexity through simplicity. Let's go, Ashton. Which one are you gonna grab, Nico? All right, Joseph, let's go, buddy. Backwards run. Here we go, Kellen. Come on, big guy. Oh, he wants that one, okay. Watch out, Joseph, don't run through their game. Go back, Mavi, go back, Mavi. Come on, Philomena. Make sure you're looking at what you need, guys. Don't just run without looking, okay? Go, London. There should only be three people down here at a time, guys. Let's go. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? So they gotta bring it back. There's a lot of extra running because if they get the wrong one, they gotta bring it back right over here. What are you gonna grab, Kellen? 
We're almost done, guys. So this might be the hardest game based on how it's situated, even though they're all very similar. And we're gonna end it here in a couple seconds because clearly you guys get the gist and we're a little ways away from ending it. So uh, we just love using these giant pieces. Um, we probably don't use it enough in our classes. Uh, this is like the first time this year already that we brought them out. So probably just need to get more in the habit of bringing them out because there's so many different game options with them. These three games just scratch the surface. Nice job, you guys. Way to go. Keep it up. Okay, make sure you drop it and don't throw it, okay?